All right, guys, welcome back to Full Moon Hot Rods. Um, we're out here in the shop tonight. We're gonna mess with this old Model A a little bit. Uh, I believe I'm gonna try to put the the brake pedal and all on it that I made back or right good ways back uh, when I was had the body and all on a Model A chassis and everything. So I think it's gonna work on the 32 chassis. It should. Uh, my brake pedal uh, was off of a 48 Ford coupe and. Um, I had just made up all the brackets and everything for the um, master cylinder and for the pedal and all to swing on. So I'm gonna take that master cylinder pedal and all and see if I can get it in this 32 chassis that the body's on now. So um, I'll show you all the master cylinder and um, we'll take it over to the car and we'll start fitting and see if we can get it on. All right guys, here's the brake pedal and stuff that uh, I made up for this thing a long time back. I did go back later and change it a little bit. I dropped the master cylinder down just a little bit and I reshaped the pedal from the 48. It was just too long, so I've cut it down. So I'm hoping I got it about the right length. Not really sure till we start trying to put it in, but um, I guess we'll get at this and see what we can get done. All right, guys, <clears throat> we're under the car now. A while ago, I took the, while I was setting up, I had took the brake pedal assembly that I made, and uh, I took it, put it up here where I think I want it at, which I think is somewhere right in this area right here. And I took it on. Uh, I kind of leveled my master cylinder as far as for the fluid and everything. And um, I got to tack this onto the frame. And then I got to figure out from the center here up how high my pedal's gonna be and then cut a hole in the floor and hope that I'm right. Um, usually I put these on before, but it should work out. If not, I might miss on the hole in the floor. And if I do, I'll patch in a place. But um, let's see, let's see what goes with this. And, um, but you can see where I had marked it, right here on the frame, where I think it needs to go. So I'm gonna tack this thing on here, and then I'm gonna take the back brake pedal, I believe, and flip it around backwards where I can run it up to the firewall or the kick panels and see about how high up it is and put me some marks on it. At least where I know how high to go and how low to go as far as the top of the pedal and the bottom of the pedal. So let me see if I can get this tacked on and uh, then we'll see what we do with that brake pedal. I don't want to put too much of a tack on it because <clears throat> I may have to take it back off and move it around and shift it or whatever. So now I'm going to take the pedal. I'm going to flip it around backwards, I hope. I'm after all this is hot. I'm not after really nothing else. I 
also go there and just measure from center here to your highest point and pull it off the center here up there and that'll get you real close too. I just did it the dummy way where you don't have to read the ruler and all that stuff and the tape line. Alright, let me see if I can get this marked out and we'll knock a hole in the floor and see if we hit in the right place. Alright guys, you can see where I took the pedal. When I put it on the back side like that, I rolled it up. And all I was doing was trying to get my height of this piece right here. And it ain't, it's not gonna be dead on, it's close. So now I gotta cut this hole here, which is gonna end up being a little bigger than that as far as height wise, because of your pedal going in and out. I just don't want to cut it too big to start with because I may end up having to change some stuff. But I'm gonna drill some, hole, some holes here and here and then I'm gonna cut a little piece out and then see if I can slide this pedal in there and then put it all back together and then see how it works. So let me see if I can get, uh, get this here drilled out. Oh, that's my broke bit. So let me go back and get another bit. All right, now I'll cut that all, that little piece out there in the middle. And then we'll, I may have to oblong the hole a little bit or widen it or something, but we'll see how close that gets us.
All right, guys, there it is. So let me put the linkage and all back on the brake pedal. All right, guys, I got it down now. Of course, sitting back on the ground as far as on the lift. And uh, let me uh, let me switch this camera around. All right, guys, here's the brake pedal in the in the car. I haven't got the pad for it yet, so I can't do that. But I don't know if you can see it or not, but. Gas pedal will be here, and there's the brake pedal right there. But I may have to make my rod a little shorter, a little longer, or even I may end up having to cut some off of the pedal itself right here to uh, get it where it sits right. I'll know more about that once I get my, <clears throat> my brake lines and everything hooked up and get brakes on it. Of how much adjustment I got on it, but should work, guys. Should work. All right, guys, that's where I'm gonna end this one, I guess. Uh, as far as the brake pedal and all, but um, it's pretty simple. It was a simple little mount to make. Uh, it saved a few dollars. Is it worth it? I don't know. You have to ask yourself that, but um, to me, it was worth it. I just like making stuff. So as far as being able to build it and it all work out, I kind of like that myself. It's a lot, to me, it's a lot better than buying it, but you know, whatever, whatever somebody likes, that's, that's just the way it is. But um, I appreciate y'all watching. And if you're watching the videos for the first time or whatever, hit that subscribe button. Help, help the channel out a little bit. And uh, I'll see y'all on the next one. I don't know for sure what I'm going to do, but I know I got to patch these doors. And I need to cut that gas cap lid out of that um, that old gas cap. I mean, I, I had the old gas tank. So I guess I may do that. And I got a few parts and stuff starting to come in for it that I had to order. So I don't know what I'm going to do next. It may be a surprise. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Y'all take it easy.